If you take someone and you sleep deprive them for 21 hours and give them about 25 to 30 grams of creatine, it completely negates the cognitive deficits of sleep deprivation. Okay, so this sounds like absolute bullshit. Does anyone really think some creatine can totally override the detrimental effects of a poor night's sleep? Well, that's actually not what this study illustrates. Everyone who hasn't read the study gets the wrong idea, including me when I first heard about it because the term sleep deprivation here, extremely misleading. To me, sleep deprivation means you get less sleep than normal, but in the study, participants simply stayed up a few hours past their bedtime. This study reported that participants were sleep deprived for 21 hours, but this just means they didn't sleep for 21 hours. Let's be generous here and say the participants normally get a full eight hours of sleep per night. That means that normally they stay awake or are sleep deprived using the study's terminology for 16 hours. So being sleep deprived for 21 hours just means that they stayed awake five hours more than usual until 3.30 to 4 a.m. In fact, participants were explicitly told to get a full eight hours of sleep before they stayed up past their bedtime for the study. So it's entirely possible they got more sleep than they normally do leading up to the experiment. The creatine group did score higher on cognitive performance tasks though, but that just demonstrates that creatine is beneficial for the brain. It doesn't demonstrate that creatine carries some special sleep deprivation reversing qualities. And for all your supplement needs, check out the free Natty Plus Chi Chi. It is in the description below.